Hi, everyone. Welcome to CRN In Depth. I'm your host, Rachel Espayat. In this weekly series, we dive into the biggest CRN story of the week with the fellow CRN reporter who covered that story. From robots roaming the show floor to new captivating cars that change colors, CES is always sure to wow the thousands who attend, and this year was no different. In this week's episode, we have assistant news editor Mark Horanis to join us and discuss some of the new technology that came out of CES 2020. Hey, Mark, good to see you. Hi, Rachel. Thanks for having me. With much of the world still focused on hybrid remote work and what that looks like, what are some of the laptops at CES that are reshaping the work environment? The Lenovo Yoga Book 9i. It was on display for the first time. So this is a laptop with a dual screen, meaning if you have the laptop open, there's the normal screen in front of you. But then also where the keyboard typically is, is another screen. So this is really good for remote work because you can work on two completely separate files on the same laptop with that dual screen technology. Another good one was Motorola's new Think Phone. So this is a really powerful phone because it has built-in security and artificial intelligence already in it. It's also preloaded with Microsoft tools like Office 360, Outlook, and Teams. One of the cool little features is it's a push to talk feature from Microsoft Teams. So this is kind of like a walkie talkie like audio communication. So through Teams, you can instantly just communicate with your team members with that new push to talk feature. So that's really cool for hybrid work because you can talk to somebody immediately. And it's kind of like a, a fun little feature that you can do. Sounds like some really cool enhancements to really make working remotely really come to life, right? <laughs> yes, and, and at CES this year, it was over 100,000 people in person, Rachel, and that's the biggest it's been in years. And I'm sure that that also drew in the crowds because this was the first kind of full year of being back into the swing of things since COVID. Speaking of COVID, one of the cool innovations that they had about COVID on CES was a self-test breath analyzer for COVID that is reusable. It's called VR War. So basically what this allows you to do is a person can blow into this small device and within 60 seconds, it tells you if you have COVID or not. It uses cartridges that are reusable, meaning that you can use this multiple times when you're testing yourself. And all you have to do is breathe in it. So that will be huge and the creators opti technologies, they've submitted it for the FDA for approvals. One thing I love about CES is that you really never know what new technology is going to come out of it. What were some cool or wacky things that were also there? Definitely, it's called the Samsung Bespoke IA Oven. Oven, that doesn't sound too, too interesting, but this type of oven can tell you what you can make, the meals that you can make, based on the ingredients that it knows you have at your home. And if it's about to burn, it will tell you an alert to not burn your food. So this is just a next generation type of, uh, you know, home appliance for cooking that was really cool to look at the features. Well, I know what I have on my Christmas list for next year. <laughs> Mark, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. Thanks, Rachel.